When we think about power supplies, aesthetics isn't the first thing that comes to mind. Wattage, form factor, and efficiency are usually the traits that make it to the top of the list. The RG Loki seems to have been created to challenge that assumption. Most power supplies are pretty plain looking, which is fair given that many PC cases have a shroud which covers the power supply anyways. But this isn't the case for small form factor builds, which is what the Loki series is designed for. This SFXL power supply is, in one word, remarkable. The weight of it in your hands makes you feel like you're holding a solid block of precious metal and its aesthetics elevate it to a work of art. The brushed metal finish on the grill, the transparent fan exposing the internal components, the ROG logo etched inside. These are just some of the features that completely blew me away and I feel that the product pictures online simply don't do it justice. The ROG Lowkey also comes with impressive specs. This variant packs a whopping 1000 watts. It's also ATX 3.0 compatible, has a 10 year warranty, supports ARGB, and is rated 80 plus platinum. The power supply cables come in a very basic but nice to have drawstring bag with the ROG logo. There's a standard 24 pin motherboard cable, two SATA cables with three connectors each, two PCIe cables, one with two 8 pin connectors, and the other with just one 8 pin connector, a Molex cable with four connectors, two CPU 8 pin cables, the infamous 12 pin cable, and an ARGB cable. As you may have noticed, the cables are individually sleeved, which makes them super flexible and easy to work with. But now it's time for the real test. Let's see if we can install the ROG Loki into my Meshalicious PC. Fitting the power supply itself was fairly easy. It simply slots in and the screw holes lined up perfectly. The hard part was routing the cables and getting them to fit inside the tiny space. It was honestly a bit of a rat's nest, but thankfully the sleeved cables made it a lot easier to deal with. It's not the best routing in the world, but I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. Now it's time to plug it in and see how it looks. I'm not usually a fan of RGB, but seeing the Loki light up still put a smile on my face. The lighting pattern is controlled by your motherboard, which means it can be synced up with the rest of your PC. It's rare to see this level of craftsmanship in the realm of power supplies, where most of your options are just plain metal boxes. But why shouldn't power supplies look good? After all, they are the one component that could be reused for build after build after build. The ROG Loki might not be the most affordable option out there, but in every other regard, it quite literally outshines the competition. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.